champion. Come on, let's go! Oh! Oh my gosh! Good YouTube, it is your boy LSG Melly, and I'm bringing you guys episode four of The Walking Dead. We're nearing the end, y'all. Things have picked up a lot of casualties, a lot of death. It's been, it's been a crazy ride so far, and to think that is really not over yet. What else do they have in store? It's crazy, man. But no long intro, we're about to just hop right into this thing. If you guys are liking the content, please like and subscribe and turn the notification bell on. I really appreciate that. Like I've been saying in every episode. These episodes are long, y'all, so make sure you guys got some snacks. Make sure you use the bathroom. Make sure you say goodnight to your loved ones if it's late because we're about to embark on another journey, all right? Now, just stay tuned. I'll see you guys in the gameplay. Previously on The Walking Dead. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Yo, this yeah. right here was crazy, the bro. The problem? Ooh. Just get in. Was trying to protect all of us. Holy shit! She's stealing the RV. How was she? Know much about you folks, but I can How was she trying to protect all of us by shooting Carly in the tomorrow. face? Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? You're his dad. You gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. I could have done that, but that's just what I felt at the time. He had to do it. You and I are stronger alone. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! You son of a- ah! Now they probably gonna blame me for that. Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need- Who the fuck? Y'all might want to rethink your plan. Now back to Lily, bro. She shot Carly in the face because Carly hurt her feelings, bro. That's who we really had in charge of our group. Miss sensitive, unstable ass. I'm I'm glad Lily's um Car Lily yeah Lily I'm glad Lily's gone, bro. But Ben was the traitor. My love interest got shot because of Ben. Oh my God, Ben. Any opportunity to get you out of here, you're out of here, bro. Should have thrown you up the train. Should have killed you. Soon as you told me, boom. That's what it should. That's what should have happened, bro. Episode four, around every corner. Oh. Oh, on me, leg is still broken. Is it broken or did he just sprain it? I don't think it's broken. He wouldn't be walking right now. Can't I just hold it? Clementine, got a lot to talk about. Not now, Clementine, maybe later. Just for a little while, no, don't we're ask getting me. real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe, Maybe I can... Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. How's Omid? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Okay, let's sit in the street then and let him rest. It's not safe to stop out here in the open. We need to keep moving. He can rest after we find a boat and get out on the water. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're going to have to carry him. You're going to have to carry him. What? No, that's nah. not an option. 
We can't. Lady, I've known you for all of 12 hours. You don't get to say we unless you mean just you and him. Uh. Mm -hmm. Since this all started, I've seen the best come out of a lot of people and the worst come out of a lot of others. Guess we know which side you came down on. There you go again. And he's we. Right. He can't slow down. There is no we. There's us, and there's you and your boyfriend slowing us down. He can't slow Who down, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> you taking a look around lately? It ain't that long a trip. Krista, Kenny's right. The longer we stay out in the open, the more dangerous it is for all of us. I'm not leaving him. No one's asking you to. No. We just gotta keep moving. All of us. The minute he... Can't you help him? His leg The minute he decides really he can't walk no yeah, more, that's a wrap. You're right. Omid, here, give me your arm. What the hell? Help. Maybe the Church? city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. Are you sure? What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Right. Oh. Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive. <laughs> oh, the radio. How are you? I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Krista, shut up. What is this? Who the hell is this? <sighs> Hello? Hello? I said answer me. Clementine, who is this guy? He had to have been talking to you. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? Bro, stop speaking in riddles and say what you mean, bro. It tolls for thee. <laughs> Oh boy. But the bell attracted them. Everybody, run! You gotta be out. Shot. Oh, me running pretty well right now. Is that a writing error? Because he just took off, but no one would know. Oh, Kenny. Kenny! Kenny! Oh boy. Gotta spring into action. Oh, hold on. Little too close. Don't you think? No! Oh hell no. Ben, do something! That is not what I said. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. No! Help her! Get her the hell out of here. I'll catch up with you. I don't even remember this dude's name, but thank you. Oh, Move Ben, your you're asses. dead. River Street's right up ahead. Ben, you're dead. All. Ben, you're dead. Ben. I'll give me a fucking break. Wait, where the hell's Chuck? Oh, that's his name, Chuck. Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. No, we don't. We gotta get out of here. There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be fine. Just go. Yeah, see, he got it. He got it. I'll get the door. Oh my gosh. Well, at least you fell inside the house. You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We gotta get him inside. Clean him up. So he broke his leg? Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. I'll you know they can I'll find a way in. Just everybody shut the hell up. Ben? Nah, go right to... What the How's hell? He looking? I'm alright. You're not alright. 
You've reopened your wound. He walked over here by himself. Blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected. It could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. We'll take over here. Uh. Try not to worry. It always looks worse than it really is. Except when it's a bite. Yeah, well, it's not a bite. We're gonna get you fixed up. Just get us inside the house, will you? I'm on it. Krista, yeah? I'm Thanks. No problem. Krista, you've been acting like a real, like, like, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna just say it. You've been acting like a real bitch. Like, what's, what's up with you? Dog house. Looks like something was buried here. Just a dog house. Damn. Nah, all right, Ben, 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 you gotta talk. Ben. About, about Kenny, the, yo. About what happened back there on the street. I know, I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. Yeah. I hear you. I think we could get the windows open about Kenny. Let's talk about Kenny real quick. I, frankly, I don't have nothing else to say to you, but we're gonna talk about Kenny. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck, at least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. All right, we are. I'm gonna go check things out. All right. I have nothing else to say to you. I just had to let that be known first. Let's check on Clementine. That was that was probably traumatic for her. Let's talk to her. Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? Uh, try not to worry, Clem. Try not to worry. Even if they saw us, they can't get in here. We did. Why can't they? We're a lot smarter than they are. They're just like dumb animals. They can't open doors. We used to have a pet hamster. One night, he figured out how to open the door to his cage. And when we woke up, he'd eaten half a box of cookies. I don't think <laughs> this is quite the same, Clem. <laughs> yeah, right. This time, we're the cookies. Just stay oh, away from wow. the cage. And we'll see about getting us inside the house. Crazy comparison, Clementine, but I'm going to let you get away with that. Okay, we got how to chill with them for a second. All right. Kenny, what you think, bro? Oh, let's. Ooh, how this? No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Didn't even try. No way we're gonna force that open. Not without making a lot of noise, at least. No way I'm gonna bust through that. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. <laughs> I just wanted to hear him say it again. Lee, no way oh. I'm gonna be able to bust through that. All right, Lee. Uh, okay, never mind. Let's talk to Kenny. Are you holding up? How's the doors coming? You think maybe someone's still inside? Nah, we'd have heard from him by now, all the racket we're making. But whoever was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. Nice place to hole up. We could just figure out how to get in. I think I'll go have a look around. But why would they board up somewhere that they're never coming back to? I'm so lost. Uh, let's dig this up. I don't think I want to start digging up God knows what until we find a way into that house first. Lee, you're being. Mm. What else is it, Ben? Do you have anything for me? Ben. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. I'm gonna go check things out. All right. Where else could I possibly go? There's no more options. Pet door. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Bullshit. 
Every day's a school day. All right, so where's the dog? It's probably buried. So we're about to dig up this dog. It, what if the dog wasn't even buried with the collar, but we have no choice. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. I'm going to time back up. What's buried down there? Been there for a while. Whatever it is, it's been here a while. You, I can smell it from here. Gross. Clementine, honey, come sit with me and I'll need. Let Lee work. Thank you. Back up. Oh, God, the smell. Yes, we get it in steaks. If not, if, if you don't got the stomach for it, then just back the hell up. Can't get it off. Uh, okay, that is not cool. Jesus. Well, you got it off. Are you okay? Chris, are you pregnant? Why did that make you throw I'm up? Fine, honey. It's just the smell. At are the you sure you I said I'm fine, okay? You might be pregnant. I know that. Like I told you, I'm a dad. I I know I uh, throwing up. I don't trust me. Need that Trust me, I get it. Digging up dead dogs for today. Just the smell of something can make y'all throw up. I get it. Even though me was about to say, you sure? Like he was about to say something. Ah, uh -huh, let's see. It goes nothing. Ooh, yes. Nice. God damn. All right, Clementine, go do your thing. You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Mm. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Yep, okay. Clem, what do you see in there? Nice. Oh my gosh. Don't ever do that again. I was only trying to help. That's not the point. That was dangerous and stupid. You don't know what might be in there. He feels Can hurt. We maybe have this conversation. Well, she, inside? she had to hear it. She I had to hear it. Like hell. I should have told her a good job, but listen, man. Listen. It's okay from here. Everybody in. Oh yeah, guns out. A little harsh on her, don't you think? What the hell? Krista, you just got to this group. Please shut the hell up. I'm trying to like you. I'm trying. Uh. Sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. Feel better already just being off my feet. His Thanks, eyes man. look drugged out. But yeah, Krista, you you're very opinionated for someone who just came to the group. And you don't even like so, groups. When were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. I only Do found you out think yesterday. That might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Krista. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? They weren't friendly. In case you haven't noticed, I there's a lot of twisted them. folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. I don't know who it was. All I know is they're no friend of ours. Damn right. I'm telling you, mm -hmm. they don't want us getting to the river. 
Maybe they want those boats all to themselves. Well, we'll see about but that. But if that's the case, why didn't they leave yet? Anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. I agree with Kenny. Let's rest up. We need to go find Chuck. I think we could all use a little time to rest up and gather our thoughts, Kenny. At least until those walkers outside wander off and Omid's feeling better. He best feel better quick. I ain't gonna wait around here too long. But he got some booze. Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. I don't like how Kenny still thinks he's my boss. I guess you don't want my help, huh? You've been helpful enough to stay with Krista. Sorry, um, let me apologize. Hey, I'm sorry if I went off on you a little. You know it's only because I want you to be safe. Look, I gotta check the house. Just stay with Krista and Omid, okay? Okay. Gotta apologize. He feels better now, good. I feel great about that. All right, check cabinets. Everything is most likely cleared out. They boarded up the place like that. Nope. Nothing. Over in the water. Water's off. I didn't expect no different. All right, they got dog food. No one's eating that, so why would I check that? No power. No power. Damn, it's gonna get pitch black. I didn't mean to. I was trying to walk fast there. It's gonna get pitch black in here soon. But why are they grabbing the dog? We walk faster. I'm not that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. Backyard door. I should finish checking the house before heading back. I was just checking to see if it's locked. No one is trying to freaking look inside, uh, go out there. Must have stopped working a while ago. Must have stopped working a I'm while ago. I'm trying to walk faster. How do you How's walk it faster? Coming? Bottle of whiskey. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Board. We could board things up with that. That's where we came in from, right? Okay. Nothing hiding in Bathroom. here. Bathroom. Painting. Little scuffle exactly went down there. My style. Family. What could have been, right, Lee? We get it. Open sesame. All right. So is it open sesame All or is it here. or is it open says he? Now, I heard it was open says he, not open Just sesame. One more to check. Stairs. He said one more door to check. What what door was that? Yeah, this door right here. Uh out with thee. Jesus. What? What happened? It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. Lee, just keep it out before you get scared by it again. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. 
Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Oh, hey, Ken. Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? Right. I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Oh. Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. I mean, here. Did he scream or anything? Put your gun out. Y'all have a real bad habit of not having y'all gun out just in, just because. Kenny. The hell are you looking at? Kenny. You okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Oh. Whoa. Why he got why he kinda look like duck? Kinda looks like duck, don't he? Yo, that's serious. Just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Starved Jesus to death is Christ. crazy. I don't know if I can do it, Lee. Not not again. I'll take care of it. I can't ask you to go through this again. Let me take care of it. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. Done. Here. This will make it clean and quick. What are you doing? I thought you said you were going to take care of it. I'm sorry, man. I, I don't know that I can. I don't know that I can either. Take the gun. You're right. I can't put you through this. I thought he was asking him to give you the gun. I'll do it. There's a bottle of water. A bottle of water up here. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. And oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found him when I did. Hold on. That's a thumbnail. Maybe. I don't want to walk too close and he bite me. Uh, I'm not about to use a gun. Was already weak. We should bury him. I'll take care of it. That's pretty messed up, bro. 
that they made us go through this. We avoided it with duck, but we they still wanted us to feel that. Oh man. That's insane, bro. Bury him right next to the dog. They're really starting to hit us with the feels in these later episodes. Wow. Damn, poor duck. I know that's not duck, but still, man. The kid looks a lot like duck, and we literally had to take out duck. No burial, just left him there in the wood. They are about to really make me keep doing this. Clementine is really attached to my hip. Every time I'm doing something, she's always finding me. Thumbnail. Hey, hey. Stay away. You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I'll kill you. Lee, what's going on? Someone was watching us. I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. And you, you don't look I'm so fine. good. I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing. Ben, I don't like the you thought of one bit. Out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we are moving some out. First, we bro. only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Will you search it if you wanna? I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place where I more... said I'm done with this house. Yeah, you talk to Ben like that. You, you keep that energy away from me. We could scrap. I held off punch you in the face on the train for good reason, but don't don't start that we mess can do now. We both. Ben, you take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful while me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. We have to stick together. Absolutely not. Okay. We will. But right now, we all need to focus on finding a boat. But what about what you promised? You said it was going to be just you and me. I know I did, Sweet Pea. I haven't forgotten. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. We all need to stick together as a group. Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. 
So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Oh. Keep an eye on me. Stay and protect Clementine. No offense, Ben. No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? Exactly. Great. Just great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. Confidence is earned, Ben. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you pulled. You feel me? Yeah. Look, yeah, I feel you. Lucky I ain't tell... You're lucky I ain't tell Kenny yet. You'd have been on your ass, bro. So you could you could unfrown your face, bro, before we me and him on your ass. Infected. East Bay Street, Lincoln Street. That was kind of a thumbnail. I gotta start being mindful of my thumbnails. I think it's safe to be there. Sir. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, river's right up ahead. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, you've been acting like bitch. that bastard's fucking with us again. It's oh another boy. trap. No, listen, that's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Sure, watch out though. What in the hell is going on? Maybe they're trying to distract us. Maybe they're doing us a yeah. I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> Lee is so unserious, bro. Let's keep moving. <laughs> Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Oh my god. Damn, the bolts are sunken. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Uh... Are you sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. Maybe we need to start thinking about a plan B. This is the plan! It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Yo, Kenny. You know what? Go drown. Go drown now. Go go die. You yo yo go go meet Katja and Duck, bro. Well, Katja, I don't know about Katja because you know she off herself. This man. one might still be salvageable. You better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. <sighs> Yo, Kenny, you, you. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Kenny, you, you're you're two seconds from being thrown in this lake. Me holding your head under there, and I'm holding you by your ankles, bro. Cause you you pissing me off now. Fucking way too crazy to me. Whoa, what is all this? Hold on, let's go look at this. Shish kebab walkers, damn. Stay out. 
morning? We'll do something like this. Rotisserie zombie? Damn. Why would I shoot the zombies, bro? Back to the telescope, bro. And oh man, great needs a quarter to work. Go oh, hit it. Damn, built solid. All right, Kenny, you stole that chain from Larry, right? Give it to me now. You got a quarter on you? Don't have a lot of use for small change these days. Maybe you can find one on the street somewhere. That is not what you could have just said no, bro. Anyway. Oh, cash register. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Yeah, that would have been too easy. Always the hard way. Must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. Someone already looted the place. And it really wasn't much to loot. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. AAJ2. Nothing here. Why make me walk here if there's nothing to do over here? More markings. Could be military tags, but what do they mean? Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot them though. We we get it. Jesus. And you don't even, you don't even look like you're really trying for real. Oh, a newspaper machine. Hit it. Yes, sir. Be the scavenger. No always count on myself. Screw you, Kenny. Huh? Fuck. What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the water line. Well, someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? Yeah. I already saw it. What the, what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Okay. Abandoned. Like every other place in this city. Got a boat on the on no docks. No boats. Of course, there's no boats. They took all the boats. No way that one's salvageable. That one is way nothing over. but water. Not a boat to be seen. Yeah, man. What the hell? Yo. Get Yo, down. that's the Get down. that's the person who was ringing the bells. They coming over here? Oh, we gotta ambush them. Why the hell are we hiding? 
Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Maybe it's just a scavenger. We didn't come here looking for trouble. Yeah, well, it seems to have a way of finding us anyways. Look, this could be the guy from the radio. The one who's been messing with us. If he is, we can put an end to it. Right now. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side and cover your flank. Kenny, you always Come want static, quiet. bro. Take him by surprise. I get you're going through a lot right now mentally, but you can't just be just going around trying to, talk to punch guy. everything. Oh, we're gonna talk. How did Kenny get over there so fast? Where'd they go? How in the hell? Bro, I, I caught it. Kenny. No. Clementine, where the hell you come from? Clem? Please don't hurt him. And Kenny, what are you doing? You're not from Crawford. Oh shit, it's a chick. Have you been following us? You're not the Crawford? What the hell are you talking about? Kenny, no, it's not our guy! Oh my gosh. Now she got no, he's with us! Are you people? Everyone just calm down. I asked you first. I asked you first. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. Hi. So sweet. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? Yeah, Everything beyond that barricade. What the hell happened here? You sure you want to know? Yes. Look at that thing. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Oh, because of Clementine. Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Why no children? What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. All the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. What did... What exactly did Crawford do with all these burdens? What happened? Probably lined up right here. Well, you met some of them already. Fuck me. Yeah. Anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed, a drain on their precious resources. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Wow. That's sick, bro. 
probably sick of anything we've encountered so far. Um, what are you doing here? Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. <laughs> I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people yeah. are. Calm down, Kenny. The Finally, the somebody talking to Remember? him like like yeah, that, like well, giving that energy back. Whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the area. Do you call them out. geeks? Geeks. Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival, they'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? We're just trying to survive, I need to get back here. We're looking for a boat. Came down here looking for a boat. Hoping to get our people out of here find someplace safe yeah good luck with that anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other any that got left behind Crawford stripped them for parts cars too there's got to be something if there was do you think I'd still be here I've been over every inch of this city this whole place is picked clean god damn it fuck hey moron so where do you, you stay keep your voice down Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Oh my right. god, this is just what we needed. This is just what we needed. Isn't that the gunshot must have brought him back? Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a Oh she already out? Okay, we can't do that. Hey! You're just gonna leave us here? Sorry, I must have missed that part of our conversation where you became my problem. Don't leave us here, please. Thank you, Clementine. Come on, make it fast. Whatever heart this woman has, you reached it. Oh, fuck me. Come on, come on, hurry. <laughs> Air me left behind. Come on! Come on, man. One good jump. You're gonna drop me again. I know you are. Uh, of course you did. No! Hop over the garbage can. Yo, scoop pushing it. Hop that. Oh, man. Get your ass out of there! God, can't get it open! Here, use that to pry it open. Okay. Buddy. Yo, hurry up! Oh my gosh! Woo! That was close. Dumbass. Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Ugh, traveling the tunnels. This actually might not be a bad Shit. idea. No flashlight or anything. It's black. Still solid. I can't see. I gotta look on my second screen. Why does my second screen have more light than my first one? Hold on, let me turn the brightness up, y'all. All right, I put the brightness up on my main screen. No way I can pry that open. Didn't you? Uh, okay, all right, we got some places to walk. But didn't you pick up that thing that she gave you? I 
can only imagine how it smells down here. Dead rat. I am not looking at that. I'm not about to eat that. I still hear the. I still hear the. Li how did I not? How did I not know this was gonna happen? There's no way I can take on all of those things by myself. Nobody's asking you to. Okay. that do good thing I'm out here and not in there hmm. seems loose shit I can't attack it you know what I'm gonna make it go the other way Turn some more. Don't turn any more in that direction. Is he still standing there? He is. Okay. So turn it back this way. And then take it off. And then beat him upside the head with it. Do I keep going? Oh. Nice. Good thing I decided to come this way. I almost killed myself. I would have walked right into that walker thinking I could attack him and then I would have got eaten. Huh? Big brain, big brain, big brain plays, y'all. This way. Here they come. Go we'll run. Go we'll back. Why is my screen turning red? At the last of them. Okay. Yes, sir. Like, like, like she said, not that hard to uh, outsmart the dead. Chuck. Oh my God, Chuck! He must have tried to hide out down here. Poor bastard. Damn. No bullets. He must have saved the last one for himself. Yep. And they, they had their way with him. Better, old man. They had his way with him. Sheesh. Guts spilled out. Hey, yeah, he, he, yeah. Well, at least he's not going to come back. At least we can say that. Boom! Yo. No, not this again. No, not the gun. Fuck. I want to restart that. I want to restart that. Did not mean to shoot. I'm restarting that. That is not. I panicked. All right, we're gonna take our time with this again. Cause. Ooh. Let them all go past. Let them all go past. All go past. Sir. All right, we're gonna we're gonna use the the ice pick again. Okay, Chuck. Oh my God, Chuck! You must have tried to hide out down here. 
Poor bastard. Chuck gave us some good advice though. No bullets. He must have saved the last one for himself. You deserve better, old man. He did. He actually helped us get out the street. Okay. We're gonna be careful with this again. No gun. Okay. Okay. Let me free myself. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. Yo, you see how Yo, this game they they slick. They made the gun the the A button when usually it's it's like oh they wanted us they wanted us they wanted to get us in trouble they wanted to see how level headed we are because anybody would have just pressed a shot the gun and got the whole the whole sewer would have been after us they think they so slick with that broken ladder i'm not gonna be able to pry these bars with this Right, broken ladder. No way I could pick that up on my own. How you can't pick a ladder up on your own? All right, we're gonna have to get crafty. She be able to do it. Ah! Oh, what the hell? Oh, we got. Ooh. It covers something up. I still kind of want to try this again. Though. Damn, I can't reach it. Yeah, Lee, I don't know who you thought you was, but I have faith in you for a little bit. What are the odds we found Chuck down here? You see how everything lines up? the hell we get your gun out must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters beds wonder if someone's living down here the fact that you see Look beds someone probably is, is living down here Chuck got months. down here and who the hell covered up the entrance oh your gun out Lee I hate when Lee just doesn't have his gun ready Ready for the action, bro. Oh. Who are you? Oh. It's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he I'm be from? from Everywhere here. else around here is dead. I think you better start talking. Came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. Let's talk about this. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Bro. I'm not from Crawford, but I saw what they did up there. It made me sick. I'm not like them, and I don't think you are either. I think you're a good man. Lee! Keep back, or I swear I'll shoot. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Bro, I'm not about to Relax. kill y'all. I'm not here to hurt you. You're really not from Crawford? No, I'm really not. Well, we are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so their perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or, 
vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. <laughs> How did you find your way down here? That's not important, walkers. Oh. A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Can you show me the way back? Thanks. I think I can figure out my own way back. Vern, you're not just gonna let him go back out there alone, are you? Those sewers are like a maze. He's got no chance of finding his way back without a guide. You're not gonna be able to get out of here on your own, but we all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? If you don't, I'll kill you. I have to get back to Clementine. Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? No. No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. Yo, Bree, shut up! If I'll just sit back and let that happen like, to someone else. Yo, I need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go. Kind of thick, too. You could come with us. If you won't breathe. Yeah. More the merrier, right? I could tell with better graphics, Brie will be looking like some, some, some nice. Be looking like some nice. Clementine, Clem. Look how ruined through the house. Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? Where's Clementine? Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Relax, I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, by the way. I think you have something that belongs to me. Take your little toy. Probably be doing, probably be doing something else with it besides just kind of pick locks. You be doing with that backside of it. <laughs> Yuck. Please, thank God you're back. <laughs> Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. All right, we'll get out. Do your thing, bruh. Clementine. Clementine? Bedroom door. Clementine, you here? Hello? Ollie? What are you doing? Oh, you know, 
Just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Thank you, just answer the question. See how we gotta get tough for you to answer the damn question, bro? People will really bring the worst out of you and then be like, oh, oh, oh they'll just check downstairs. Should have been told me to go check downstairs. Clem? Clementine? How do we get downstairs? Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Cabinet. Clementine? I highly doubt she'd be back there. I thought she was gonna go check the cabinet. She drew something. Clem's drawings. That's me. But where is she? Why is this suspenseful music playing? I'm pretty sure she's fine. Little game. Do we go back in the same room with Molly? Okay. Boxes. I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. How are you going to tell me what you care about? Did I ask you if you cared? Oh, did, did I tell you to search the box? Clementine! Where are you? Oh, the stick. See, it's so dark, I couldn't even Clementine, find the damn stairs. Come out, please! Kenny? Look at Kenny getting drunk. Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. First good thing that's happened since... What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? Hey man, I tried, but he gave me a look like he was gonna rip my face off. He won't listen to you. You think he was gonna listen to me? To hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Look at Ben, bro. Kenny, I can't deal with you right now. You're a grown ass man. I'm looking for Clementine. Not under here. Right, Clementine, you're really outdoing yourself right now. Where are you? Doesn't look like she's in here. There's another door over here. Doesn't look like she's in here. All right, what about that other door? Here. Doesn't look like she's in here. Yo, Clementine, this is becoming ridiculous. Clementine? Clementine! Shed door. Door's coming. Jesus, Clem. Clementine, you're really making this gameplay right now, I see. All 
All right, we gotta go back in. Oh, I know y'all heard. That. I know y'all saw that. scary how you get in there let's just say hey hey girl come look look what i found how'd you get in there and how'd you make it look like nothing was touched what are we looking at a boat Wow. This was here the whole time? I know, right? Look at this drunk bastard. Yes, sir. I'm shocked it's not dark yet. How much time has gone past? Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why no, are you even still here? I'm making you Hey, nervous. if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? True. That is kind of fair. Well? <sighs> you want the good news or the bad news? Bad news. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Uh... Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me. You don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back yeah. of my Yeah. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's... Actually, not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So... It's decided then. We're going to Crawford. All right, we can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Thanks. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? 
We should and go tonight. Die already. All right, I'm tired of looking at your I'll face, bro. I'll go let people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. Yeah, talk your shit. All right, we out. Got a plan. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Yes, it'll be dangerous. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we Honesty need to is what got us this far. Honesty is what's going to keep us That's going. We have to do this. Got to always be honest. Stay. I don't want it, anyone else to die. Like, we don't have anything else. We don't have. We have each other. Neither do I. No one else is gonna die. I promise. You can't promise that. I can't. At least she's smart enough to know that. No, I guess I can't. Sorry. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this. And you said I'm a big help, remember? Crawford don't like children, Molly I'm sorry. Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means what it must hell? be where my mom and dad are, right? It might not be safe. Or it's dangerous for children. Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Not right now, though, Clem. Can't I come with you? No. No. I'm sorry. Don't just leave Clementine at the house. I know she's hurt. Look at it. It says it all on her face. But if something happened to you at Crawford, I wouldn't be able to live with myself. I would not be able to live with myself. Sorry, Clem. Ooh, we getting ready for. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people. Even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben, Molly. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we're gonna have to make a decision. Hell. Yeah, I'm not serious. Look, I'm just saying. If we want the best chance of... Ben, you out of here. Where'd Thickums come from? Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Don't put your foot down, Doctor. Look. You already probably not even coming with us. Hold up just a sec. Y'all can go back into our little shelter downstairs. You was she about to stay with Omid? to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus, you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omid. What should I do if something happens while you're gone? I let her run a hot. Give her a gun. A gun? Doesn't Omid have a gun? If that happens, if you see or hear anyone outside trying to get in, I want you to find a place to hide and stay there. And don't come out till I get back. Do you understand? Find a place to hide and stay there. One other thing. If Omid gets worse while we're away, if he tries to hurt you, you know what to do, right? Ahead. Aim for the head. Let's get you inside. Damn, is this gonna be her and Omid? I thought Krista was gonna stay too. Uh 
Let's get this over with. Dude, why you snatched it from him like that? <laughs> Damn, if I was gonna have a weapon, I should have I should have gave her the gun then. I hate when a game does stuff after I already make a decision. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Mr. Lee, sir. Oh my gosh, I thought somebody was right there. I'm getting too, getting too Let's anxious. Go. Is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Hell, like a walker. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, trying to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. Oh, why'd you stop walking? What the I fuck? I knew this was a walker. He looked like a walker. Why are walkers just roaming around? Don't, did, did Crawford get overran? What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside, fast! This episode is long, bro. Oh. Fuck. Fuck. Do you think they saw us? Probably. Your guess is as good as mine. Shit. Your answer freaked what Ben out. What the hell happened here? I don't here? care about Ben. I this ben place can, was supposed to be secure. Ben could go back what out there for happens, all I, I care. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. We'll play flag football with them no, outside. I don't care what good. Ben does. I don't care how he feels. I don't even think Ben coming with us. We should leave now. What? How the fuck is this good? Yeah, what is before, he talking about? everyone at Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey. Trying to look on the bright side here. I agree. So long as we don't let him box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Yes. Or do you want to get what we need go and get the hell out of here? Go outside and play with them. Matter of fact, you go be a distraction, Ben. Come on. I think I know which way to head. We don't even need you. Well, we do need you. Go do that. Yes. Yes. we will be useful for once. I got a bad feeling about this. Well, not gonna lie, I do too, but still. Gotta see it through, we're already here. Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. This is school. How big is this place? A 
Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? How ironic is it that Crawford wanted to keep all the week out and they still all ended up turning into walkers? So ironic. Bro. Here. Just give me a sec. Batteries. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Medicine? Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? She used to... It's obvious that she used to live here. Makes sense, doesn't it? So then we just... That answer was very suspect. It's just tell them you used to be right here. Right next door. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Uh... Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Right. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Why'd you give Kenny the axe? What am I gonna use? Well, I think I got a gun, right? I kept the gun. Yes, I kept the gun. I think I didn't give it to Clementine. Nice, 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 nice. Talk to Ben. I don't have nothing to say to this door. Be out. All right, Molly. Can't be leaving me like that. Where'd you go? The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Dipped on me. I'm not even trying to be wandering off like that. So I'm not about to go look around. I still hear walkers. Like I hit him. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? I mean, I know you heard her open the door. But why is she traveling so far ahead of me? How are you supposed to be Molly, having my back and you, you leaving here? me, bro? Guess I'm not going that way. Looters will be shot on sight. Damn. Talk about honesty, bro. I just saw somebody run past me. Don't tell me that guy is following us. Ooh, good skills, Lee. Garage door. Damn, it's jammed tight. But Molly really just dipped on me like that. <laughs> Better not get too close. What were you doing up there? What the hell? Molly? Got an ex-boyfriend which you so mad at a walk Molly. What? You must know this one. I think you got it. One more. 
He's must... wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. <sighs> must have been her ex-boyfriend, bro. Did you find what? us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Where the hell you get oh, yeah. that from? That'll work. Matter of fact, it doesn't even matter where you got it from. We gotta hurry up. This gonna be making all this damn noise. Oh my lord! Oh! That one's still alive. She didn't even kill it. Damn, they're dumb. They saw us Take a crawl look under there. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. They saw us crawl under here and still kept walking straight. Right, battery. Battery right there. Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. So what is it? Never mind. I can't reach it up there. The alarm is on. That blinking must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. All I know is you try to get that down. You're you're, you're chanting it. Ooh, lift panel. You're chanting this thing going off. No power. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take my chances on the outside. It said lawyers will be shot on sight. It's locked. No way in. All right. I gotta tell her about the damn. She gotta help me do something with this. Something you need? Uh, about the walker in the alley. What was all that about back there? He came at me up on that rooftop. Tried to take a bite out of me, so I took care of business. What? You got a problem with me killing geeks? No, it just seemed like you went to town on him a little more than you needed to. Hey, you never really know when those things are all the way dead. I was just making sure. Look, you want to get this battery or not? Time's wasted. She know that. She know who that was personally. I'm going to have a look around. You do that. Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. All right, I gotta find a way to get. I gotta find my way to get this down. I'm gonna need something to help. I need. I, she's yo. She's just standing there, bro. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Now where would I get that? Do I get it from the truck? Looks like Crawford already used this battery for something else. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. Okay. All right, Lee. Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Molly, give me a... Yeah, ice pick. Something you need? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda. Hilda. That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? <sighs> I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. Once people start naming objects, they I got are... your promise now. Not a scratch. 
they're reaching cert they're reaching psychotic status so yeah she named this thing yeah I did it whoa whoa oh my god that's probably not good no shit all right, give her back hill, I'll though. Try to hold it it must take Hurry. the battery. There's the battery. Finally, something goes Bro, right. Bro, take the battery so this shit can shut up. Still attached to the terminals. So, yeah, take them off. Still attached to the terminals. Lee, I'm about to smack you. I'm about to, I'm about to punch you dead center in your face, bro. Yes, sir. I'll take it off. It's off. The negative terminal's still screwed on. Got that one off. Now pick the battery up. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put kick, it in here. I'll carry kick it. Kick it. Kick that red thing. Kick. Oh. Okay, follow me. Bro, kick it. Move your ass. How'd she do that? Oh. Shoot it out! Oh yeah, we're gonna have to do it anyway. I think I kept the gun. Now you're gonna pass that? Oh, she's gonna help me. She's stronger than Kenny. Kenny would have dropped me. Okay. And so now we're on the roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Yeah, because I can just do that, right? Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! You know what? What did you call me? Yeah. Well, now that you mention it... If she catches me, she's way better than Kenny. Yo, she lift. She lift for real. Kenny... I, don't get me wrong, I understand Kenny was shot, but damn, bro. She didn't even struggle. Probably Come on. all that roof climbing later. with something I gotta do. Kill what? Though. Catch you later. Wait, you've still got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! God damn it, what the hell is she doing? Yo, is she alright? Yo, she can't be dead eyes, bro. Can't open it without the combination. She held on to it for insurance. Place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. Hmm. It's real conceited to have your nip. You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. All right. First they'll be making me feel like feel like shit from trying to be a good person, trying to help. Hell casings. Little help! Little help here! Fuck the doors won't close all the way! This. Oh my gosh. Oh. That hold. Damn well better. There's so many here. Yeah, we know. Alright, let's go through the door. We're only enticing them. Let's not start high fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Penny, everything weighs a ton to you. Hey, how'd you guys make out? We got the fuel. Awesome. Good job, guys. How you doing with that door? Not so good. 
Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Thanks. Alright, let's spit some game. Let's, just, let's spit some game on Bree real quick. Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. Mm. I don't think we would have made it without you. Mm. No problem. We're <laughs> all on the same team. How long have you known Vernon about Cross? Uh, yeah, let's let's talk a little bit about the cancer survivor. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah. You know what? I'm somewhat of a college. cancer survivor myself. Been in treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all <laughs> this happened. Lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? Listen, I'm not poking fun at cancer survivors, y'all. There's people in my family who have survived cancer, so I, I'm, I'm not making a joke about that. I'm just, just, just messing around, y'all. Uh, how long? Have you how long have you known Vernon? A couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great, helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together, kept us alive. Hmm. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old, even children, those least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. How did I'm everybody a busy die? Here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. How the hell did they like how did everybody end up dying what do we still need we already got the fuel and the battery once we find some medicine we'll be good to go so where's this battery you found molly has it she ran off to do something well she'd better bring it back here i don't know why you trusted that girl with it we hardly know her she saved your life didn't she <laughs> yeah but what has she done for me lately Lee, I mean, Kenny, what? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? Tell him if I you want. That him. has nothing to do with me, bro. Like, Rose talk. Um, yeah. I agree. I think you should tell him. Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. Ben, listen. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose. But he's still in a real bad place. You tell him now, he's going to lose it, and then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it, but it's not now. Not yet. I hear you. I'm going to get back to this. Yeah. Tell him if you want, bro. But when he chew your head off, trust and believe me, I will not be helping you. And I can promise you that. All right. I know they said they got the medicine, but they need to hurry up, bro. They need to hurry up. Shell casing. Who the hell was shooting? Already been fired. They're worthless. Come on, yeah, yeah. We need help. Shit. Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. 
How did they get in there? Do I want to do this? Yeah, I want to do this. Yeah, come to me. Huh? Sir. Yeah. I know they you heard all the, the shooting. hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. Uh -oh. Took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. We bust it open. There's no way we can bust it open. Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Well, maybe they did just leave it behind. Never know. I'm not shooting it open. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Sonogram? What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. I think I think you would know all about that. There's dried blood on this print. I think Krista's pregnant, y'all. On the floor. Looks like that trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? Take it uh, already cleaned out. Camcorder, no tape inside. I have to take time to rest later. I think I didn't, I, I wasn't trying to make you take rest. What is this a copy machine? Not that it matters with no power around here. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Uh. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Got a tape. Phones probably haven't worked in months. All right, I'm going to go to the game quarter. Let's see How's what we're talking about. Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Uh, all right. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. What are the odds this camcorder is actually still charged? Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Mm. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Ah, uh, so that's her sonogram on the floor. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Oh, and with her being pregnant, she's going to get kicked know, out the, the rules group. are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. Damn. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow, or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Damn.
Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Search his body? I'm not going back outside. This is day 82 since the outbreak. Hey, no, 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 no. Seven, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. All right, so it's looking like I have to come out. I have to go back to that doctor's body. All right, so from what I could remember. From what I can remember, he was this way. I mean, the doctor's body was this way. Who would have thought I would have to come back here? Where the hell did Molly go, bro? Okay. Good job. Who do that? It just randomly fell? Okay, thanks, I guess. He's still alive? Oh yes, he didn't kill him. Okay. Randy, you're in boot. Uh huh. All right, let's check his body. That'd be something useful here. Another tape. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. How am I getting back? Shit, time to go. Oh, I am so glad they did not make me do that all by myself. He, he, he did it on his own. Thank you for cutting and saving gameplay. I found another tape. This one's dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. A 
Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Damn. What code is he putting in? Uh, oh! No. 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 He didn't even try to make sure he was dead. Well, that, that did it, though. What code did he put in? I don't think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Krista, you've been tough this whole time. Do not let that... And... That's what they did. Krista, this isn't the time. We've got a job to do. You're right. I'm yeah, sorry. I don't got time for that, bro. Let's get those meds. You've been being a bitch to me this entire time we've met you. I don't got I'm not feeling sorry for We're you. We're in no. business. No. Open Antibiotics, the Antibiotics, morphine. Yeah. Take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You go on ahead. I want to make sure we didn't miss anything. I'll be right behind you. Don't take too long. Else is there to check. Two tapes. No, I'm not watching that again. Sonogram, blood, draws. Vernon and Krista already took everything we need. There's nothing else in here. Nothing in here, I guess. Blood, sonogram, camcorder. No tape inside. All right. We already watched the two tapes. We're done here. Yeah, we're done here. Where's Molly, bro? Oh my. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Yeah, this is not the time to be playing around with me, bro. Here you go. Did he, what did he, where did you What's put that? it? Nothing. Sure there's nothing you want to tell me? Yeah, I'm sure. Are we done? What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Sorry, I just got spooked by those bells, um, and then I heard someone coming. We're okay. Did you what get you that door to open in the with? classroom? Not yet. Look at the Kenny thing in his hand. Kenny sent me to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Oh. Where did you get that? My. I just found it. It was God. stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh no. Oh, shit! Oh. Ooh. Almost shot her. Nice shot. Thank me later. Come on. Ben, we gotta go. Ben, move your ass. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. 
Oh, shit. That ought to hold him. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come then, on, damn you! You're such an idiot. This is my fault, all my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean, this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, you know what? save it for later. Go ahead. The door. I let them in. I said save it for after we get out of here. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Ooh. Hey, man. I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little piss ant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whoop his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Yeah, Kenny. Nice group you got. As soon as we got out of here. Not the time, Mommy. As soon as we get out of here. This asshole out of here, you thinks he's have. getting on my boat after what he did? He's out of his motherfucking mind! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's you go, not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. You go Might as well be to, this piece of shit again. right here. Well, I vote we leave it. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Oh. I have nothing to say right now. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? Oh! Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! So much for the armory. What's left of it? Damn, thick arms. A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Oh, hell no. Not that way. Fuck! That's not going to hold. Back upstairs. Ooh, we get that. Look. Shoddy. Hell yeah. Shoddy to the body. Hell yeah. Lee, you did not have to use it right now. Just go up the stairs and use it when you need to. Huh? Sure. Why are these walking so fast? Get the hell out of me. Not gonna lie. Okay. Come on! 
Any way out of here? Down the ladder. This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think oh, we can do Oh, what are you bringing this. up the, the, the Well, what are we station? waiting for? Go, go! Come on, let's go! Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh man! Oh! Hold on, man! I've got you! Climb up! Come on, you can do it! There's no time! You have to go! Now! Quit fucking around, Ben! Come on! Let go, damn it! Get the others out of here! We. Damn! I'm in a... We, we both know. Let me go. He's not even trying. Ben, bro, I'm gonna. You lucky, Ben. Go, go, go! Don't ask me why and be thankful, bro. I think you would have helped. Now, Kenny, you can do whatever you want to do with this kid. Oh, Mead? I have nothing to do with Nothing. I'm not stopping you, bro. I am not stopping you. Do what you feel you need Clementine. to do. Clementine! Yeah. Uh, hell no. Open that. Don't warn them you're about to open the door. Just open it. How do walkers Jesus get in fucking here? Christ. Where the hell is Clementine? Clementine! Lee! You made it back! Told you I would, didn't I? Did you find my parents? What happened here? Clementine, what happened here? One of those things tried to get upstairs. I stopped it. But what about my- Upstairs? Omid. Oh, I'm pretty sure she would have said Omid got bit. Real good. Hey, what do you say we go check on Omid? Krista? Everything okay? Omid! He dead? He lost too much blood? Hold on. Is he dead? Well, if he is, well, Krista, that's one less person on the boat. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. What could Krista, you get away done? from him? Mm -hmm. uh, oh. Hey. Back already? We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. <laughs> You right. okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes. Thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Copy that. Thank you for the help. Listen, man. About what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean... I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? 
That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone yes. can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What? What kind of an offer? Offer? I'll take her off your hands. Take her back with me, to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids what? of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. She, I promise. she, she's That's not even going to want to go with you. Isn't it? To be safe? I'm going to pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. What's with all these old that farts? Girls in my yeah. Care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Mm -hmm. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is going to wind up dead. You hear me? Yeah. Take your hands off me. Or what? They got care about you being upset now. Lucky all I did was push you up against a wall, bro. I should have gave you one of one of one of one of these, bro. Should've yeah. Hey, going somewhere? <sighs> Oof. Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. About to leave? Oh, all right. That or right, whatever. That might be for the best. Boat's gonna be crowded as it is. You kind of strike me as more of a go it alone type. Yeah, I've always had a hard time relying on other people. Although I've got to admit, you've given me a reason to rethink that. Listen. I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Sure. All right, bye. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. You were a great help, but I don't know. Something about your character just throws me off a little. Right? One less person. And Bree died. So. It's still going to be a little crowded, hey, though. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? I don't know. Some someplace else. We're going to split off. You and me, we're going to go our own way, just like we agreed. Mm. We don't need anyone else. It's just going to be the two of us. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. No, he's about to get his ass beat. Ben's a good kid. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's gotten a feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. He is. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Uh. <sighs> I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here. Like I always longer. said, honesty is the best policy. Oh, uh, just, just apologize. I'm sorry, Clementine. I'm so sorry. If she turned her back to me, she ain't trying to hear it. I'm just... There's really nothing else for me to say. I'm just let her cry it out. They left for radio. Parents are dead, bro. I don't know why he... I don't know why we can't just tell him that they're dead. Oh, he's going to stay in there with her. Okay, let's some time fast forward. 
Yo, this episode is long, bro. I gotta edit this. <sighs> Come on, time. Clementine? Did she take the radio too? I, I better not have gotten left. I'm gonna tell you that. I'll tell you that. Clementine? Clementine! I'll tell you that. I better not have been left. Oh, God. Her hat? That same guy probably came and took her. The radio. Yeah, she definitely got taken, bro. She loves that radio. She wouldn't have just dropped it. Pick it up! Say hot bite, Lee. So, show him the Where's bite. Clementine? Show She's the not in her room. Vernon ain't show in the, the house bite. either. What the hell show is going on? Bite. Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. Oh no way. my. No, no fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? I don't know what to do. I'll go alone. Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. Well, me, you feeling better? So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Thank you. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Really. Lee, man. You know I care about Clementine. And I am a Christian man. And I keep asking myself... This was me asking you for help. What? Asking you to put your life on the Kenny. line. Kenny! Would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. Kenny, what the hell? Kenny, man, I'm begging you here. I can't do this alone. I need your help, please. Lee, I know you had my back when we first teamed up. You really looked out for me and mine. But ever since then... You've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. I'm sorry. What are you You're talking about? What about you, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Clementine's one of the few good things. Ma, left I helped you, Ben. You just she come, bro. A kind word for you, ben. Kenny, are you serious? Don't you think you owe it to her to help? You're right. I owe her. I swear, before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. Gave Ben a chance to prove himself. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. 
See if he took her. Kenny, I'm not going to lie. Fuck you, bro. I'll get the boat out onto the river. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Until you get back. Why are you talking to me, At least until nightfall. You're still going to take me. Even bit. Yeah. We'll figure out what to do about that when the time comes. Talking about I've been looking out for myself. I helped you kill on, Larry. Guys, let's go. I helped you kill Larry, right? What else did I do? I saved just duck. Duck. I liked you toward the end, but you're still an idiot. I saved your dumbass son when things started hitting the fan with Sean. Right? I came to the farm to feed the kids. I helped us get out of there, out of the things, out of the little freezer, so we could help save your family. I sided with you more than I sided with Lily over a lot of things. What I'm taking your I? advice. I listened to you multiple times when you told me not to do something. What is he Looks talking like about? Here in a hurry. Vernon, get out here. There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Yo, I'm going on two hours and 35 minutes. Can this episode end, please? Kenny got a lot of nerve saying what he just said to me. Oh. Are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! That's not Vernon. Whoa. Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Please don't hurt her. No time left for chapter five, right? All right, let's look at our choices. Ooh, let's look at it. Let's look at it. Let's look at it. Let's look at it. Okay. Did you kill the boy in the attic? You win 73% of players killed him. Okay. All right. So that was the well favored choice. Did you lie or threaten Vernon? You and 57% of players were rational and honest. Bro, if I wasn't, he probably would have shot me. Did you bring Clementine with you? You and 52% of players left her at home. That was the smartest choice. The smartest choice. If Omi died and turned into a a a a, a walker, we already told her what to do in that in that case. And plus, he was hurt. He couldn't barely walk. She can handle him. Plus, he's little. He's 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 smaller than Krista. <sighs> Not that there's anything wrong with that, but I'm just saying. Did you let Ben fall to his death? You and 45% of players pulled him to safety. I kind of felt bad. I kind of felt bad dropping him. I didn't want to drop him. Did you reveal the bite to the group? You and 80% of players showed the bite. Yes, I've been honest this whole time. Might as well keep the honesty going. Nice. Who came with you? Oh, so it's Ben, Omid, me, and Krista. There was an option to actually get the whole group to come with us. How do you do that? How do you get that choice? I'm so curious, y'all. How do you get that choice? 16%, that's the highest one. I got the second highest, though. It ain't all that bad. Damn. 
Ew. There's a there's an option to just be you and Ben. Yuck. No, actually, just you and Kenny is the highest. How do you get Kenny to come with you? He started acting like a certified bitch at the end. I don't like Kenny no more. Kenny, I don't like you no more, Brody. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Gonna lie. All right. That is the end of this episode, y'all. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. That was awesome. That was so fire. Oh, I can't believe. Yo, like I said, I played this years ago. I played this back when it first, first, first came out. There's a lot of things that I did not remember, bro. This game is crazy. Wow. And, and to think that I still got a lot of other, I got a lot more Walking Dead titles after I got the second season. This four seasons, I think, even a side game. Oh, we lit. All right, y'all, but that is it. Make sure you guys turn that bell on so you can see when I dropped episode five, last episode of season one. And yeah, this is LSG, guys. See you guys in my next video. Peace.